Hello, people that just learned chess and want to improve their mating skills. W today we will look at how to checkmate a lone king with a queen. So first we need to do, of course, is to get a queen on the board, which we have after promoting the pawn. Uh, so black wants to stay in the center of the board as much as possible. So our first task in checkmating the black king is not to give checks, but to, to cut him off and make sure that he cannot go where he wants anymore. So he puts the king in a box, as you can see, and he cannot get out. Please note that the queen also takes control of the diagonal because black, in some situations, might hope to be still mated and sneak away with the draw that way. After we cut off the black king, well, black needs to make the move. So let's say king to f5. Now, the second thing we need to do is bring our king closer because we need both the king and the queen to deliver checkmate. So king b2, king to e4, because it wants to stay as much in the center as possible. King c3, king f5, and now we can play king to d4. The white king stops the black king from going to e4. The queen still blocks the, the king from uh, going up in this situation. And since it also has control of the diagonal, the black king needs to make a step backwards. Now, we cut the king off and we make the box smaller, which is kind of key. So you want to keep making the box smaller. And now the black king needs to move in that box. Let's say it goes to g3. Then a good thing to do is to face the, uh, the enemy king and just step right in front of it if you have a queen. Now black just has two options. Well, it can also step backwards, but then if black decides to step backwards, then we just make it smaller again. So let's not do that. Let's say uh, black moves up to g4. Then we have check. Note that uh, the queen also has control of f5, so black cannot escape. King to g4. King to f3. And after king to h3, checkmate. Let's go a few moves back. So here we gave black the choice. I also want to show you a risk you have to be aware of. If black now says, okay, I move the king down, I move the king to g2, then you can give check. The black king moves backward. And now, if you think, oh, I now I need to move the king closer again, uh-oh, you have taken away all squares for black king, but there's no check. So this is still made, and in chess that's a draw. So you want to prevent that. The proper move is to move our queen to g1. This keeps the king cut off, and now we can do not much. He goes to h4. We're going to put our king in front of the enemy king again. And after black moves, let's say to h5, boom, here we have checkmate again. So I hope this was illustrative. This is how to checkmate the black king with uh, only a queen. In this series, you also have, uh, I also already have uploaded overkill mates with uh, how to checkmate with queen and rook or how to checkmate with two rooks. Uh, keep uh, watching the channel because I will upload all other possible checkmates as well. So keep tuned for king and rook versus king, king and two bishops versus king, etc. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Bye bye.